In this video, I will show you how to create a FireMonkey database application using LiveBinds. So let's start by creating a mood device application in Delphi. I choose here the blank template. So I have here a mood device form. And to this form, I will bring some components. Let's start by adding a list view. Let's align this list view to the client. And uh, let's connect this list view to a database using LiveBinds and FireDAC. So let's go to the, our data explorer and uh, expand the interbase node. So we have here some database and uh, I'm going to choose one table from the DB Demos database. So let's bring here the customer table. And uh, when you drag and drop the a table to our form, automatically our ID will add uh, a connection using, in this case, FireDAC to the selected database and also a table component pointing to um, the customer table, as you can see here. So let's start by doing uh, binding the fields to the list view. So bind visually. And if we connect the database, active the database connection, you have now the fields available to properly connect to the list view properties. So let's choose here the contact field and the connect to the text. And as you can see, we rather have data in the design time. So this is the power of our LiveBinds technology. I'd like also to have this list uh, grouped by the first letter of my customer's name. So to do this, let's, st let's start by organizing the customer table uh, by the contact name. So we just need to, in the customer table, we just need to add an index. So in the index field name properties, you, we are going to choose here contact. And uh, if we close and active the table again, we rather have the data organized by the contact name. The second step is to connect the contact to the header text and the also to the header break. In the header text, we need to set the few header custom format property to show only the first letter of its name. So we use here the format, the substring to get only the first letter of its name to show in the header, as you can see here. And uh, in the header break, we need to configure also the few break customer format using the same expression to break the, the groups using the first letter of its name. So if we run the application, you have a list view connected to an uh, interbase database using FireDAC and the group by the first layer, letter of each name. And uh, as a last topic of this video, let's understand how to add a custom format to our data fields when using LiveBind. So I added here um, a panel and uh, let's align this panel to the bottom. And uh, in this panel, I add a T edit uh, let's connect this to add it to the contact field name. So let's organize here our editors uh, and then let's connect the contact to the text of the T edit field um, edit control. You have, of course, the same information from the list view, but um, Let's select here this binding, this connection, and add some custom format to the field. So you can use a lot of custom format, formats in the operations with the uh, live binds. This is available um, in all of your connections uh, when using live binds. So I pick you here uh, the uppercase option the uppercase formatting option. So I say here uppercase of the value. And the, including in the design time, you have the data 
now with the custom format working doing a uppercase of the name if you run the application you can see everything is integrated is synchronized so you have in real time the uppercase of the field being displayed in this t edit and uh, with this we are finishing this topic about a firemonkey database application using live lines.